Y'all get ready? Yes, you get ready. Shout out to all my tea sippers out there. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your tea cups ready because you already know this tea is what? Piping hot. Life is a mystery. Everyone's always hating on me. Why can't I be his chick? Boy, I just want some dick. <laughs> All right, you guys. Good morning and welcome to another podcast, okay? Brought to you by Lovely TTV. So what's going down is this. Comedian and actress Lonnie Love from The Real. She's basically in her feelings right now. She's definitely feeling some type of way about social media. They have been going in on her new relationship with her new boyfriend, James Welsh. So this is what Lonnie loved to, to social media to post the other day. She says, amazed at times at the folks concerned that I'm dating a white male. But for years, black males have dated white and exotic women and no one questions it. Hashtag love while you can. So once she posted that, of course, it went viral. Everybody and their mama had an opinion of the situation. And, you know, Lonnie Love is a really cool lady. I got a chance to hang out with her this summer. Very down to earth, really sweet. And I'm happy for her. She seems even more happier on the show now that she's getting some damn pain, okay? She seems really happy. Every time she smiles, you, you see all 32 teeth, bitch, okay? You can see her molars. That's how hard she's smiling. And I'm happy that she's found love, you know? But I will say this, in her comment, uh, she says that, you know, when black men date white and exotical, no one questions it. And I do have to disagree with that because I know a lot of black men who date outside their race who are celebrities and they get a lot of backlash. People will call them coons and sellouts and everything else. So, no, black men, they do get a pushback, too, from the black community for dating outside their race. Um, but... Yes, black women definitely get more vitriol. You know, anytime I've seen anything with like interracial couples, especially if the woman is black and the man is white, she's all types of bed wenches. She's the white man's whore. Like people really, really go in to tear down a black woman who dates outside of her race. You know, I think it's sad. And I think at the end of the day, people need to mind their damn business, okay? Back up! Back up! <laughs> mind your business. That's all. Just mind your business. You know what I'm saying? Like I said in my previous video about Nikki and Jamie, it's hard enough finding love out here. You know, finding true love, finding your soulmate. And if you happen to find that in somebody of a different race, then so be it. At the end of the day, you have to live your life for you. You have to be happy with your situation, with your circumstances. Nobody can tell you what happiness is. And if you find that happiness in someone of a different race, that is your business. So, like I said before, whenever somebody's dating in an interracial relationship, you have to have tough skin. You have to ignore the world. You have to let folks have their opinion. But know at the end of the day that you two are in this together. Because if you allow social media and people's opinions of your relationship to start getting in your head, you won't have a relationship after a while. So I hope that, you know, Lonnie stays strong and she just, you know, continues pushing forward, getting that pain, bitch, okay? We see all 32 teeth. We want her to keep pushing forward, living her best life, and saying, F social media. I found love. I'm happy. Let her be happy, okay? So like I stated, I wish Lonnie Love and her, the new love of her life, James Walsh, the best. So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire situation concerning Lonnie basically blasting social media for, you know, sending her a lot of hate and, you know, derogatory comments about her dating a white man. And then do you agree with me when I said that, you know, a lot of black celebrity men get also receive backlash when they date outside of their race. Maybe not as harsh or severe, but they also get it as well. So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. In. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation concerning Lonnie Love and the new love of her life, James Walsh. All right. Deuce.